So the point of this room is up here. And this cutscene. side of the statue. We'll be going through that later, but I am going to do some training off screen. change what he said. Well, you, you won't notice the training on screen, but we're back here, heading up the lift. We know way too much about him. Which is why I'm just gonna go through this one really quickly. Yes, Albert is really going to destroy him. I'll show you it's magic too, because Congo, weak against magic. And Albert's magic is wind element, so it's the strongest magic to use against him. And the legend cast will boost his power, even though that was doesn't Albert doesn't really have So one hit kill. However, let's see if Wing Blaster is enough to get the one hit kill. Wing Blaster looks cooler than Gaspless. Yeah, it's not nearly enough for one hit kill. Jade Dragon is dead. The most powerful magic. Boosted forces all of them are by the magic field. This is the reason I did the trading. So that you could see this. But he's got a gun battery on his back. Pretty impressive looking attack. Though I'd have expected him based on his appearance to have opened his mouth to attack. That would have been really cool. <laughs> bye bye to his armor. Yeah, Kongol. Kongol just got glixed. It's been a while since I glitched somebody, but 
Congo, you got glitched. Did they just break the fourth wall? I think they just glitched him so bad they broke the fourth wall. Look at that. 
He's a dragoon. Well, of course he's a dra dragoon. You think he'd give a dragoon spirit to Graham and not keep one for himself? No. He's not gonna give someone else that kind of power and not have it himself. That that's just not a very smart thing for a villain to do. Those kind of villains get us get usurped by the minions that they give too much power to. So it is really cool how him turning into a dragoon makes his swords glow. Violet thunder energy. He's the thunder. Which means none of my attacks will be super effective against him, and his, his lightning attacks won't be super effective against any of my guys. He'll be not very effective against Shell, but I'm not really going to be using him in this fight. See the characters I'm using, and his shell is not there. There's no need to train his shell at the moment. Oh, that move. That's gonna delay things a bit. nicely with the Thunder Element theme that he's got going on. Glowing swords. Glowing purple swords. Purple energy shield. Which blocks all my attacks from damaging him. Which is why I'm using this time to guard and heal. And the purple lightning bolts. With that magic attack. And then there's this attack here. Like a kind of portal opening. Using lightning bolts down at you. While he slashes at you. Goes back. And concentrates it. To a big old ball of electricity. That even spreads out. And kablooey. Still gotta defending because the shield's still up. Even if particular characters reach full health. Ah, he's using this move again. See, that looks to me very much like a portal. It's strange how the portal gets concentrated into this big old ball of electricity. Blue is impressive though. Boom! He's in a red. In the red. This is gonna hurt. 